I've had this UPS about three or four years. I mean, as you can see, it's been sitting a long time. And I'm looking on videos and trying to find a way to hack the, uh, replace the batteries with car batteries, gives you extended uh, run time. The city I'm in has frequent blackouts, brownouts, and I have computers that I need to keep up and running. As you can see, this one's in, been sitting quite a long time. It's a 1500. Very dirty, that's where the battery would go. Paid about $50 for eight of these at a state auction. Had bad batteries. So I go to Walmart and bought a lawn and garden battery. Hooked it up and it wouldn't work. Well, I found out these are 24 volt UPS, they're larger UPSs. So I went back and got another battery. Hooked them in series. And as you can see, it's doing fine. These are some little fuses that went between the batteries, the original batteries. I just put them on the on the car batteries, lawn batteries. And it's just a little 20 amp or some fuse. All I could find on YouTube was with 12 volt um, UPSs. Nothing dealing with with a 24 volt. Once I realized this is a 24 volt. So all in all, I got about $50 invested in a UPS. That's, these go for about $200 on eBay with bad batteries. Fan kicked on. It's going through a test. I'll let this run a while on the back of my truck just to make sure I don't get any meltdowns. I'll bring it in into the computer room and hook it up and we'll test the capacity of it okay I turned it off almost an hour ago and it's
at two o'clock I turned it off, turned off the power and it's been running almost an hour. I'm running this PC uh, modem. This PC is on, it's in sleep mode and my phone charger. Everything you see here is being run off of this including this line conditioner. <laughs> 